National Park Service employees swing axes down on vegetation. My name is Joey Nagrian. I'm a vegetation technician intern for Point Reyes National Seashore, and we're out here working on jabata. So jabata grass is a, a what we call a panthus grass is kind of the, the colloquial or common name. There's actually two species of pampas grass. The scientific name for what we're treating today is Cordideria jubata. Uh, then there's also Cordideria solano, and those are two different species of the same uh, genus um, that come from South America. So a chunk, you look at this and you're like, that's dead, right? No, we've seen regrowth in pieces like this because this got moisture over the winter and there's enough cell tissue still in this plant that with moisture and light it will totally become a new plant. A piece of the plant even this size is problematic so after we take down a plant we have to then kind of piece through the ground and make sure we've left literally nothing exposed to the bare soil. It's highly invasive because it can reproduce on its own. It doesn't need anything to like pollinate, cross pollinate. And if we were to let this kind of let them continue to grow, um, then they might uh, take over the you know the whole plateau, and it'd just be jabata grass down here. Featuring Joey Negrian and Corbin Gensler. Special thanks to Ellen Hammondson. Produced by Gregory Purefoy, National Park Service.